This is a dream come true to come become your basketball coach. I'm honored and thrilled for this opportunity. I would like to express my gratitude to President John Bardo, Athletic Director Darren Boatwright, and Linda Hargrove for your vote of trust to be your coach. I would like to recognize my family, starting with my special mother, Sue, Sister Karen, nieces Abby, Deanie, Taylor, and nephew Hunter, my Uncle Vic, Aunt Norma, and Cousin Michael. To my dear friends and teammates who have supported me through the years, I wouldn't be here without you. So thank you, everyone I just mentioned there. Card number two. I want to especially recognize all the wonderful people at UTEP. I want to thank all my coaches and players who helped me in our program to make it special. We made history. We had great experiences that I will cherish forever. We sold out the Don Haskins Center twice with 12,222 fans. We can make that same dream come true here at WSU. You guys can go, yeah. Card number three. It all started in a small town in Oxford, Kansas, straight south of here. My dad was a school teacher. My parents were hard workers, blue collar, and education was the theme. I had a great experience growing up in this town playing sports, and that's when I fell in love with a great game of basketball. Played for a great coach in Jim Littell, who taught us how to be winners. And that's when I knew I wanted to be a teacher and a coach at a very young age. Coming back here has taken me down memory lane. Playing in the state tournament with my teammates, I have some teammates here, you yeah. Going to Linda Hargrove's basketball camps, I thought about that and I was even, Linda, I tried to dig in a box to find the trophies from your camp because I would have brought them here, but the box was so big I couldn't find them, but I really wanted to do that. I wanted to give it back to you. Uh, and coaching right here in Coke Arena, I've coached in here uh, when I was coaching at Independence for the uh, Jayhawk Regional Championships, so I've already coached in here. So it brings back a lot of memories, the list to go on and on. But guess what? It's home. That's what it is. It's home. After graduating from Southwestern College, I went right into coaching and teaching at Winfield High School. For every high school coach in Kansas, I want you to know my door is open. You're welcome to be a part of our program. And please note, I am one of you. And I think we have some high school coaches here, and I can't wait. I'm going to reach out across the state, and when they think about women's basketball, they're going to think about Wichita State. From Winfield, I went to Independence Community College, coached in the Jayhawk Conference. What a great experience. That's when I learned a lot about diversity, and I loved it. To all the junior college coaches in the state, my door is open. You're welcome to be a part of our program. And please note, I am one of you. To the community and Shocker Nation, my door is open. We want you to feel connected to our program. And I talked to our players about that today. And guess what? We need you. To former Shocker players, we want you to feel connected to us. We will honor and respect our past players and our past coaches who have come before us. And we need you and we thank you for all that you've done. I'd like to touch on recruiting. It starts at home right here in Wichita. And to that small town player, we will be watching you. We will be diverse. We will be global. And with the goal to be champions. Speaking of champions, I've admired and cheered from afar these past years for Greg Marshall and our men's team. I can't wait to meet Coach 
what an amazing and great coach he is. I've been very fortunate to have great relationships with Don Haskins, Tim Floyd, and I really look forward to talking hoops with Coach. As we move forward, let the work begin. We will build this program the right way, one day at a time, one step. Big challenges are in front of us. We will be a team. We will work hard. And ladies, we will rebound and play defense. Yes, let's back that up. It won't happen overnight, but it will happen with time. I can't wait for our first practice, which will be tomorrow. That's what I'm anxious about. And I can't wait to coach my first game as a shocker. I'd like for the ladies to come up here now. Come on up. So, now this part. What's standing behind me is the reason why I do what I do. I love to work with young people. I love to coach and teach the game. But this is the why. This is the why I do what I do. And we've had a great first meeting and I can't wait to get started. So, I want to thank you all so much for being here. Uh, lastly, I'd like to say, God has put me here for a reason. I'm very thankful and grateful for this opportunity. To Shocker Nation, we need you. I think you're going to enjoy what we're going to be about. Can't wait to get to know you. And go Shocks. <laughs>